Hey guys, I'm making a tutorial for um, Happily Ever After by He Is We. Um, to not complicate myself, I'm going to make this pretty short and simple. So, like, I'm going to just hold the chords and put it up towards the camera or whatever. And, yeah, it's a pretty straightforward song. Only about four chords throughout the vast majority of the song. Um, you're going to need a capo for this. I edited some of it just to make it easier for you guys and um, enjoy. So, the intro should sound something like this. First chord, it's supposedly, I read it was a C major 7 or whatever, I'm pretty sure it is or whatever, but anyways, you see, first finger, remember you have the capo on it, right here, okay, second finger, alright, and then third finger, When you place that chord together, it should look like that. And it should sound something like this. Okay. Second chord is going to be, I would say, a power chord. So on the A string, you're going to get the... I don't know I don't know what to call it, son. So I have the capo on it, third fret or whatever. Um, and you're just... You see where my finger are? Like... And then you have like two fingers down here. Okay. The other chord is played like this, but to make it more simple, like more simple, just play like these two right here. You get me? It's like it's almost like an A chord, but it's only it's missing one of the fingers. So you get me? Um Let me see if you could see that perfectly. You see that? Uh, okay. And then back up to the power chord I taught you. Did that too. So that's pretty much it for the intro. By the way, let me remind you. I just uh, I just learned this song about five minutes ago. So. That explains the sloppiness or whatever, but yeah. Um, that rasping sound they have in between off every chord is usually like... What happens is that when you press it down, it gives you the sound. But when you let go, when you're not holding the note, you just still have your fingers on it though. You get me? Like, I doubt you're going to be able to see it. But it gives you that, rasp, that raspy sound regardless. So, yeah. So... Yeah, and then when it starts kicking on, kicking into the chorus, I believe, um, I started playing something like that A weird thing I was trying to teach you, right here. Like you know, you start like palm muting. If palm muting is when you get your palm, you play somewhere on here, and you start muting the notes. It's technically like muffling the notes. It is muffling the notes. So, and then you go up to the power chord again. And then you kick it off to the regular intro, and it's pretty much like that throughout the whole chorus and everything. Yeah, it's a pretty simple song. Like, it's just straightforward. So hopefully with that, it helped. If anything, just leave any questions or whatever. Feel free to message me and I'll try to get back to them. If you want any tutorial for me to post up or anything, I'll try to see if I could get around to it. Feel free to message me, call me, rate, like, whatever. You know, whatever YouTubers do. So.